At any given moment, roughly 2,000 thunderstorms are in progress on our planet, producing about 5 million lightning bolts a day. Up to 100 of those reach the ground every second. Large weather surveillance networks collect general data, but they cannot accurately locate cloud-to-ground strikes and are too expensive for private use. Without real-time mapping of the spatial development of lightning from place of origin to strike, global systems are less precise in forecasting wind phenomena related to thunderstorms, for instance tornadoes. Especially in remote areas, knowing exactly where lightning hit or how a storm progresses would radically reduce response time and help minimize damage. Quickly developing weather comes with preventable accidents and convective events associated with lightning, such as sudden wind shear, which also pose a constant threat to aviation worldwide. The Low Light Project aims to provide low-cost and accurate sensor technology for private meteorological stations, weather-related enterprises to localize lightning strikes, track and monitor supercells. Lightning occurs in steps while emitting radio signals. By capturing very high frequency emissions, the structure and strength of each discharge can be determined. Using stationary sensors, combined with GPS communication modules, we can triangulate lightning flashes from a distance of 200 kilometers within a 100 meters of accuracy. Processed by mapping algorithms, data becomes accessible, allowing forecasters to identify locations with the most intense updrafts within convective lines. Low light integrated into alarm systems makes an affordable protection network of Sunderland towers, each covering 125 square kilometers. By increasing awareness of the storm's progress, forecasters can act earlier and issue precise warnings about the severity of events well before their formation. The ability to locally map and accurately predict thunderstorm movements provides smaller service providers with a competitive advantage against large networks. With low light, lightning becomes part of a safety network, a signal that tells us where the storm is going and the next bolt might touch down, so if we listen, we can prepare. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.